First, let's look at the forward passenger door. With the door closed and latched and ready for departure, remove the girt bar from the stowed position and install it in the floor clips. In an emergency, the door is pushed fully open and latched. As the door opens, the evacuation slide is pulled free of the door container. Inflate the slide by pulling the manual inflation handle. Now let's take a look at the aft passenger door, the tail cone jettison, the walkway, and the evacuation slide. To evacuate the aircraft using the tail cone emergency slide, first lower the attendant's headrest to expose the emergency handle. Pull the plastic cover away to gain access to the handle. Pull the handle inward and rotate it to the open position. The door may pop open a few inches due to pressure from the door seal, but the flight attendant must pull the door fully open. The first few inches of travel jettisons the tail cone. As the tail cone falls away, it pulls the evacuation slide with it. When the evacuation slide is pulled out of the opening, it inflates automatically. However, if it does not, the slide is provided with a manual inflation handle attached to the slide fabric by Velcro tape. Pulling the red handle inflates the slide. If the tail cone does not jettison when the emergency door handle is used to open the aft passenger door, there is a backup jettison handle. It is located on your right side facing aft at the end of the walkway. To jettison the tail cone, grasp the red release handle and pull hard. If the slide does not deploy, manually push the slide out through the tail cone opening. If the slide does not automatically inflate, pull the red manual inflation handle. Next, we will look at the overwing emergency exits. There are two exits over each wing. The middle passenger seat's armrest may be raised to provide easy access to the exits. The outboard passenger armrest is attached to the door. To open the overwing emergency exit, pull the latch release handle inboard with one hand, then lift the exit upward and inward with the lower hand hold using your other hand. Place it on its side on the seats making sure it is placed so it will not obstruct the exit or passenger egress routes. This concludes the Super 80 Emergency Exits presentation.